hi everyone I hope you are all fine today I am going to show you how to renumber any type of elements in auto it like rooms doors electrical elements fire nozzles low current elements and any other type of elements you want almost all of elements can be renumbered to have the suitable sequence for your system presentation of your sheets and schedules to achieve that fast and clean we will going to use new plugin from solve plus called numbering plus you can find here underneath of this video links for downloading it now let's do the job here as you can see we have a blend having some elements to show you how we will going to renumber those elements using numbering plus go to solve it plus tab click on it click on numbering plus icon you will have the interface of the plugin here it's quite easy to understand it the first number will be the first number we will use to start the sequence say we want the start the sequence for 15 we'll type here 15 or we can do any number you want sequence is the number that will this number increase the boy say if we choose here one it will be 15 16 17 and so on let it as the default value this places will show it in a moment the mask is the format for this number as shown here if we choose three or four digits it will be four like this if we choose the three it will be three like this prefix is the text will be on the left side hand of the text so um, if we want to here uh, want to add the floor number say the zero three dash it will be like this the prefix is any text you want to add in the right hand of the text say we want to add something like this here is list of all categories you can renumber say you want to renumber rooms so we type here rooms here you can find all the instance parameters that you can add this calculated number in we will choose for now the number then click picking and start choose rooms as you can see click here on room click here on room as you can see the calculated number put here hit escape to exit the plugin you can choose another um, say doors uh, here um, you may choose mark for instance you have to know that uh, parameter should be an instance and uh, shouldn't be read only and it have to be a text type not number type or integer or double or anything else it have to be text here we can start from say um, zero one and the sequence may be like this dot zero one and from here we will choose double decimal places from here we can see we will put it like this and here we will do like that or uh, maybe we can remove it and edit here 
like this so when you start baking the numbers will be like this as you can see 3 for 30 floors and 0 0.01 for the first door and the D maybe means door as you can see the number all number have the same format as we want hit skip to exit uh, another example we can do uh, for um, maybe walls um, just to use, uh, use marks here also maybe here we have um, the letter G for um, gypsum board for instance here we can have the say W means wall and uh, if you didn't type anything here we will start from the last number you have put here so you have to change this to reset the number also we can go here and start picking pipes as you want maybe here it will be CMU and as you can see it contain the numbering skip and close it when you finish okay this is everything uh, guys about uh, numbering plus i hope you like it and see you soon in another videos bye bye